My name is Bo Tyfiro. I'm originally from Centerport, New York on Long Island, and now I'm living in San Diego, California. Open Source Skateboards is about staying true to the spirit of skateboarding by building a community where we foster creativity and having fun. Open Source Skateboards is great for experienced skateboarders because we're open source, so we're going to be developing some really cool and really and really try to advance skateboards. Also because we're symmetrical, there aren't many symmetrical skateboards out there right now. And also because we're responsibly made and we're going to continue pushing for ever more um, responsibility in terms of environmental responsibility and social responsibility. We make our boards with seven layers of maple veneers. The maple we use is grown in northern Quebec where it's colder, which leads to the trees growing with a tighter uh, growth ring structure and that means that the tree is going to be denser which in turn creates a stronger skateboard deck. I see open source skateboards basically as a skateboard company both for your expert skateboarders that really need to understand all the nuances of a skateboard. As we add more shapes people can start experimenting and posting to our forums and reviewing the skateboards and saying what these specific features are better for. Like, an increased kick angle might help you pop an ollie higher, the concaves, the widths, all of that. We can get a lot more information and better information on that to really start creating a more optimized skateboard for you personally. On that same note, I also see open source skateboards growing the skateboarding community. I want everyone to feel welcome and I want everyone to be able to experience skateboarding. I love skateboards because they have so many degrees of freedom compared to any other piece of sports equipment that's out there. And the possibilities are almost endless. You know, you think you've seen everything and then all of a sudden somebody does this crazy trick and it's like, I never thought of that. <laughs> and that opens up a whole new realm of opportunity. By being open source, all of our source files, so our drawings for the skateboard dimensions and geometry, the mold file that we actually sent to our manufacturer to use to press our decks, that's all available to anyone. So that now anyone can go and if they want to learn to make a skateboard and make their own skateboard deck, we've provided all that information for them. Also by being open source, we're creating this, this wealth of information to improve skateboard design from a geometry perspective, from a materials perspective. So what could be really cool that open source skateboards could enable is now you can have a, a group or like an arsenal of skateboards for whatever type of skating you want to do today. You can have a freestyle deck, you can have a street deck, and you can have a pool deck, you know. It's just about having fun. Ultimately what we're trying to do is, is make our, our, our equipment, our tool, better suit what we're trying to do with it. So we're starting out with just two basic styles. The possibilities are really endless. We want to just keep getting feedback. I mean, feedback is going to be a huge part of this. Skateboarders will have a huge impact in terms of being able to influence what decks we design and what decks we start distributing. And I, I want to give skateboarders the ability to do that and to participate in that. That's what skateboarding is all about. <laughs>